The future of TV is here. The arrival of new Google TVs means you can now get movies and programming from the Internet directly onto your TV screen. Now, can it replace the cable company? John Batteries introduces us to a man who has tried so you don't waste your money. Apple TV, Google TV, Hulu, Roku. It starts to sound as though you don't need cable or satellite anymore to get a hundred channels of digital TV. So can you cut the cord or is internet TV still not ready for prime time? Chris Kane looks like any TV viewer, surfing channels and looking for movies from his easy chair. But there's one big difference. Most of his TV is now coming in via the internet thanks to a Google TV box. Google TV lets Chris watch many network shows legitimately through Hulu. Google TV also lets him download movies directly from Netflix. But if it does so much, then why does Chris still pay Direct TV a monthly satellite fee? Because he says Internet TV is not quite ready for prime time. Would you recommend Google TV to somebody as an alternate to cable or the dish? No. No, it's an adjunct. Google TV and similar services from Apple TV and Roku let you watch some network and cable programs via the Internet. But the key word is some. Another challenge. Many shows are not free. You have to rent them. So while Google TV opens up a new world for Chris, he says he's not giving up his satellite dish or similarly the cable cord anytime soon. Bottom line, all of these new services are promising and all of them have their pros and cons. But if you just like to kick back on the couch and watch TV, there is nothing like the convenience of cable or the dish. So you may want to stick with the tried and true for now. And that way you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris.